here. Most of the colors are pretty similar. Um, a little bit of the placement of them is different. I think the undertones of some of these browns are a little bit different. So when it comes to James saying they copied him, I mean they pretty much did. It is a dupe. Hey guys, value for value. Welcome to my true channel. We just lost another YouTuber. Ethan Peters died from a suspected drug overdose last Sunday seat. He's actually an Instagram star with over 500,000. Ethan is a kid who is good at doing beauty makeup, photoshop and short videos. He's so talented, that's why he made a boss online. He has made a lot of brand deals but he's mainly a supreme influencer and he's just 17 years old. So this teenager was on the road for something big before his life was cut short. The beauty vlogger has been struggling with drug addiction, depression and other stuff besides being an online star with a net worth of one million dollars. Let's talk about it. Let's do this in the value for viral way. If you're new, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe and share this video. Follow us on Instagram and Twitter. And also hit the link in the description to join our private chat group on Discord. Ethan had some very controversial lifestyle. He's been dealing with his inner demons. Being a teenager and belonging to the LGBT community, he has had some tough times in his life. You know, his last post on Instagram was throwing shots at those who mocked and bullied him in school. The beauty blogger also had some edgy satanic stuff. That's why I warn kids about Satan. You don't want to sell your soul for some free followers, free likes and shit. You know, because it's trivia. What are you going to do with all this free stuff? Our generation is pretty messed up because they are deceiving us with useless stuff. You know, Ethan calls himself Hellboy. He even created this brand and called it the Hellboy Match. He's following 666 people on Instagram and it's not just by coincidence. To follow 666 people on Instagram, that is 666, the mark of the base, and that's satanic. The last person who made a move was Billy Eilish, but now she's blown up. She made sure she followed 666 people just to add up with that 666 on her Instagram. These people are actually telling you that they worship the devil because they have to tell you. And it's easy because they are bodies. I saw Ethan hooking up with Lady Gaga having some pretty sweet talks about the next agenda. Lady Gaga. I don't know how many times but I've said like a dozen times. Lady Gaga is a devil worshipper and Ethan is just a kid. So I don't see why he was flowing with the devil just for some free likes, free followers and all that stuff. You know, he has some pretty blasphemous posts. Look at his dress. I am God. You can do that like you can say you are God. You're just a creation of God. God created you. You can't be God. And he made sure he posted stuff against Jesus, against God. In fact, it's sad to watch this. You can't be wearing the crown of thorns and telling Jesus to shut up. That's also the symbol of silence. Jesus Christ died for you and me so that we can have salvation. And look at this post. He's wearing the devil's wings, doing some Photoshop stuff. So I can't, I'm just sitting down like my head's cracking in half. So all these years, from 14 to 17 years, this is what this kid has been doing online. It's crazy. Okay, look at this post. He's trying to blaspheme against his Catholic sisters. You know, he's wearing the upside down cross, the symbol of the Antichrist, he's doing the all sin eyes, there are just a lot of photos. The black and white symbolism, this one is really really gross. You know, he sat down on the pentagram and he was doing some witch stuff. I don't hope he's not hearing pages from the bible. I don't really care if it's witchcraft, art or just photoshop, you yeah, gotta be very careful. Live your life in the way that will please God.
You know, kids always DM me, they be like, they want to sell their soul. It's useless. In fact, it's stupid. Because the devil gives you something you already have. But you're just having no patience, low self-esteem, and you're just in the wrong environment. You know, Ethan has these skills. He could have used these skills to serve God and lead more souls to Christ rather than doing the opposite. What happened? The devil gave him quick fame, quick fixes, started hooking up the big names, gaggers, the, the Billy Eilish. Now he's gone. Yeah, like it's pretty easy because when he gets your soul, he starts tormenting you, tormenting you until you kill yourself. Rest in peace, Ethan. We're just gonna pray for him. I hope this hell boy doesn't take him to hell. Anyways, God is a judge and I'm just dissecting conspiracies. And kids, do not sell your soul. I mean, in fact, there are many ways to sell your soul, but do not sell your soul. And stop thinking about being famous and all that shit. Everyone was born with a gift and our gift is to serve God. Father, we have to use our gift to serve God, not to serve the devil. God created everybody with a gift. That means you are perfect in your creation. We already have our gifts, our blessing inside of us, but it's just our environment. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and check out our other video platforms. Don't forget to support us on Patreon and PayPal. See you guys in the next video. Bye. Much the same. I mean, like I said, I like the undertone of this red more than this one, but on the camera so far, everything's looking pretty similar. So now for the blue, I'm gonna be using that turquoise shade and a little bit of the real blue. So a little bit of these two shades on my under eye. Mm. See, that, see, that's not cute. That's not cute. That is very ashy. Yeah, and as I'm blending it, it's like wiping away a lighter one, which is also an indicator that it's really shadowy. And also, as I'm using this, the color is dripping all down the palette. So like I said, it is very, very ashy. So.